kind of a great day. What a day to spend, I don't know, hours on a video game console. Can't believe this is part of my job today. This is awesome. Uh, Matt Ryan is here from uh, Nintendo with the Wii U out. This is a hot item for this season. A lot of people talking about this. But I don't know that there's a ton of understanding on how revolutionary the game system is now. Well, it's all about innovation at Nintendo, and that's what we offered with Wii, with the Wii Remote, which was all about motion controls. Well, now with Wii U, um, this system is more powerful. It's in HD all the way up to 1080p. Wow. But it's all about the innovation with this new Wii U gamepad. So this is a new controller, mm -hmm. a new console, but the new controller, the gamepad, has an integrated second screen on it, which is also a touch screen. There's a camera built in here, multiple options for controls, and full motion controls built into this as well. We have somewhere around four or five minutes to talk about this thing. We'll never get even close. We won't even scratch the surface on what it can do. But let's talk about the major things, the screen being the first thing. How would that be used? What's the benefit of having a screen on your gamepad? So there's tons of benefits. It's up to the developer to basically be creative with it. So some games, this gives you a second option, like New Super Mario Bros. U. You can actually play the full game on this screen while someone else is using your TV and watching Netflix. No or fights watching between else. the siblings. That's exactly. cool. Now but in a game also, like Nintendo Land, yeah. It becomes an integrated second screen into your game world, so it offers a different perspective. It could be your maps, your menus, cool. uh, or other kind of windows peering into your game world, and it's a new toy in the toy box for any developer who wants to make something creative. I like the versus or the, uh, the when you're on the same side. What's that called? You had a good word for that when you're playing together. Cooperative multiplayer. Exactly. Cooperative multiplayer. Uh, can we do a little bit sure. of that? So, and this, so this is the new console, by the way. It's tiny. First of all, very powerful, surprising how much power you packed into a tiny console. So uh, this is working wirelessly, both items. You've got the, what we're used to seeing for the Wii. Yep. And I've got the new uh, console, or the new gamepad. This is also reactive to my movements? Yep, exactly. Let's see how that works. So this is uh, an example of cooperative multiplayer. This is The Legend of Zelda Battle Quest. Okay which is one of the 12 attractions in Nintendo Land. So uh, you're, you can see me in the bottom corner, but for me, this game is happening right here on the screen. Now I hit A to start and away we go. The controls are very intuitive. Look at this, I'm looking around. Here we go and we're running, right? So yep. We gotta get the bad guys and I'm gonna shoot an arrow. Oh, I just missed him. Yep, so you've got a bow and arrow, I've got a sword and we are playing together to get to the end of these levels. Look at us go. We're super team Matt. <laughs> this is unbelievable. I really like cooperative gameplay. I think it's very cool when that is an option in gameplay. Um, just because you don't need to f extra fights <laughs> between exactly. siblings. Look at us. We're doing so well. So this is this is amazing. And the camera on the front, you said, uh, actually can act as. Oh, I took damage. How horrible. Um, can actually act as a uh, chatting with uh, fellow gamers or just other people uh, through this front-facing camera. Exactly. You may be playing a game and then a window may be up on the screen showing the face, the reactions of you winning or losing, I guess, um, which is pretty funny when you're playing with other players. We're all about social gaming and making that experience fun and unique. But yeah, right. you can use Wii U video chat just to talk to other Wii U players mm -hmm. uh, across the world. And uh, of course, it's all free. And you can Isn't do that, that on the uh, Wii U gamepad screen. So here's the thing about Nintendo as well that's been very interesting. I feel like Nintendo can take the crown on really bringing uh, women and girls into video gaming. Um, and I think that's because of the game development that's occurred. And what's interesting about this system is when we talk about the, I'm just going to put this down now sure. just so we can chat. Uh, when we talk about this system, it, the cool thing is that, uh, that you don't even know what developers, you've left it up to their imagination. Exactly. And so you, there could be surprises for the folks at Nintendo when a developer says, oh, I thought of something really cool to do with that. Yeah. So this is just the infancy of, of a brand new concept uh, in gaming. That's very cool. I think exactly. that's amazing. And this is a strict, straight up game console, right? Well, actually, um, we obviously make games first and that was, that's what it's all about. Yeah. But with video chat and what we're calling Nintendo TV, you're actually able to stream your cable, your satellite TV through your Wii U. You can actually interact with it. Is that right? Yep. Online and with social media. There's Miiverse, which is all the little avatar characters will actually group themselves together based on similar interests. Wow. Of people who are playing the same games either locally or around the world. There's a social network to this. Exactly. That is amazing. Okay, so and I just think it's it's such a game changer that it's not even there's no competition for it in terms it's like not even on the it's just kind of completely different. That's amazing. Well what the Wii U gamepad offers with this tie into the console and the 
controller being built to work with the console. Yeah, there's nothing else like that out there. That's a true innovation, something that's getting more and more rare in technology today. That's pretty impressive. And extremely easy to play. I just picked it up, and you were like, okay, do that. You didn't even have to tell me. So you're learning what it can do as you're playing, which I always think is a real bonus because yeah. On uh, the big day where you get the present, you want to make sure that you're able to play it right away and have fun, right? Not yeah. be like going through like figuring out how to do this. It's super intuitive right away. Yeah, we want the experience right out of the box to be easy and pick up and play, and that's what a game like Nintendo Land is all about. Now, if you're going to play some of the more complicated games like Call of Duty or Assassin's Creed or Batman, uh, or a pretty scary new game called Zombie U. Uh, you know, you're going to need to be a pretty good gamer to get good at that quickly, uh, but you can learn along the way, obviously. That's very cool. I like that. And I love the fact there's a new Mario Brothers game. Been waiting a while. Love that idea. Uh, the Nintendo Wii U, uh, just learning about a very cool new product. Matt, thank you so much for coming in and showing us that. Yeah, thanks for having me. 1080p, that's sweet.